everyone, Mr. Merkich here, and today I'm going to show you another little fix for the Skype tools, and that is mass messaging. Now, if you watched the last video, you know that I covered how to fix the send messaging going like a little bypass. Um, so basically, we're going to use this again because obviously we still need to send the message. We need to do it for everyone in our contacts. Now, I think people tried it, but they were saying they were getting errors. So I'm literally just going to show you to how to surround it in a try catch and ignore some errors because certain contacts and I don't know why this is but they just refuse and chuck an error back so we'll just ignore that and carry on with the next one it's essentially what we're gonna do um, so with the code from last time which I didn't show you off camera I wrote a little function which is basically called send message and we give it two parameters the user and the message and we just pass it into the open message dialog here so we don't have to write these three lines each time so if you want to do that you just want to write send message user a string and message a string and put what I showed before in it now what you want to do is go inside the function and just write try and go press enter and it should generate it for you and you just want to copy this code um, and basically we want to put this in the try section um, we don't actually want to get or display the exception we just want to ignore it which is probably not the best thing to do but we don't want this popping up when we're sending a mass message we just want to try to do it and that's it so that would be our little function now if we go and look where the mass message is to see how it works our old one anyway we're just saying for each user in our friends list send them a message so basically we want to do the same thing but instead of using our old one because it's quite lengthy with all the online stuff we'll just quickly go ahead and create a new button and a little text box wherever it is, there it is and uh, in the button what we're going to do is we're going to say like before for each user as skype for com lib.user in skype.friends what we want to do is say on error regime next send message and we want to send the message to the user dot handle and for the message it's going to be our text box which is number 48 so text box 48 dot text like that and uh, we could even put this in a try catch but the um, send message already contains one in fact we could actually go ahead and do that if you really wanted to just to be sure so try catch we'll just put this actually that might cause an error because we are using on error regime next so let's go ahead and see I've never actually combined these two together so yeah that is going to do that so we'll just have it how we originally did like so and then what we want to do is just launch it up and give it a quick test now I've not actually tested this so I'm hoping it does work uh, what I've done is I've logged into my test account because I don't want to be sending a mass message to a few thousand contacts on my usual account so what I'm going to do is go over to it we're just going to put test in here and to see that I've not sent any messages you can see there's no messages here I'm going to press send and you can see it's going through them all So there we are. And just to be sure, see so as you can see on some of them it didn't actually press enter. So to prevent that this might have been something that people were saying to me. It was only sending to the last few. You can see it sent to quite a lot of people. Um did it send to all of these? No, it didn't. So what we could do, it looks like it's going too fast. So before it carries on, we could just stick a pause in. And we can put the pause just under after it sends enter, it looks like, if we want to do. Um, so we can say system dot thread in dot thread dot sleep and we'll just say a second 
and let's give that another try. Now I don't really want to annoy the users on my contacts because I do know how annoying it actually is. But we're going to go ahead and do it again. Test. We'll press send. So now you can see with that little pause, it is actually sending it to each user. It's it's obviously slower than what it usually is. Um, because we are putting the pause in but it is going to send to all of your users as you can see it in action now it's going through them all and it's sending to all the users so there we are I'm going to cut this off mid whatever mid operation um, it's always going to obviously going to focus me so I need to be quick I might even have to kill the process <laughs> uh, it looks like yeah it looks like it's done at least so yeah, it's kind of annoying because it is always focusing. Maybe you want uh, some sort of stop button, have a boolean. If it's true, carry on. If not, so the options are there. But there you are. There's a little simple mass message fix. Obviously, it's not the cleanest um, by any means. But again, it is working. And it will bring some functionality back to your Skype tool. So if you did enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment. And I'll see you next time.